Hey everybody, and welcome back to Typewriter. Uh, now, before we continue, um, I just, uh, I guess a small story. I thought that for a while, uh, writing in literature uh, was losing out to the more conventional mediums of, uh, or the more conventional uh, automated or self-feeding mediums. And what I mean is, uh, losing out to like radio, losing out to television, losing out to movies, losing out to video games, but actually it's not. Writing is actually a stronger force than I gave it credit for because even if you have these self-propelling mediums where the audience member doesn't have to quote unquote work as much or work as hard, you know, using their imagination because the images are displayed on the screen or be literate in any sort of capacity to understand and interpret the events that are going on, it still has to be propelled by a story. And in order to do that story, in order to tell a story, in order to convey it, in order to record it, you have to write that story. So all of these movies and everything like that, that's where the books and that's where the writers go. The Jason Bourne movies, they're based on books. Lord of the Rings movies, they're based on books. Uh, 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 Harry Potter movies. God, everybody knows the Harry Potter movies are based on books. You know, writing is at the core of everything. Literature is at the core of everything, which is what inspired me um, to begin writing. Um, because it's so central to everything that we do. Even the computer programming, you have to write code, everything based off of like writing, literacy, the ability to convey thoughts through writing. Awesome, very, very awesome. The power of the pen or, you know, electronic pen nowadays is oh so powerful. And I love it. Come on, get, ah, I, I was almost there. No. Oh god, yeah, that was so precarious. No, keep going. No, you know what? I'm not even gonna trust it. Why is the A not complete? Oh no! Uh, it was like an emotional high. Oh no! I wasn't. Uh, this sucks. I mean, it's awesome. It sucks because I'm not, you know, getting it the first time. Okay. I got your number. Uh, uh, X, 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 okay. I'm here. Why? No, no. Wait, is that a U? Look at this. The ampersand down here? Oh, it just falls. Ampersand? 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 No. Oh. Well then. Now we're getting into the industrial era of America, where our city started to get uh, skyscrapers. No. I don't know where the ampersand was in this level. I don't know. But this is the final area of this uh, Times, Times New Roman. Bah. Oh no. Oh no. Can I die? Times New Roman. What I have used to write many a paper. Uh, Times New Roman. In 1921, Stanley Morrison, yeah, Stanley Morrison, a topographer and draftsman of English fonts, publishes his first book devoted to the history of topography and of the printing press titled The Craft of Printing, employed at Pelican Press, then at Cloister Press in Manchester from 1921 to 1923, he creates the Bellado character and then becomes typographical advisor to Monotype Corporation the same year, holding office until his death in 1967. 
1929, he is hired as a typographical advisor by the English Daily, The Times, and is responsible for designing the new layout of the newspaper, as well as directing the work that will lead to the creation of Times New Roman. Inspired by the preface of Plantin, font of uh, Inspired by the typeface Plantin from the Elvisor's family, Times New Roman is produced in 1931 and used for the first time in 1932. The font is designed to save space while providing optimal readability, even if printed on poor quality paper. With its short legs in notable contrast between thick and thin strokes, the Times typeface meets all of its objectives and is used for over 40 years. Yes and is the bane of many child looking to cheat their teachers out of their essays. All right, here we go. You know, it's like, yep, yeah, you guys can do this. Make sure you use single space. And it's like, uh, actually, yeah, bring it over here with me. No. Oh, come on. This is how we got to do it, right? Into blackness. The blackness. Keep, but keep on. Oh. All right, here we go. Now. No, 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 no. Uh, 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 that on it. It's so slidey here. It's easy to overshoot everything. Oh, wait, I can just press triangle to restart. A uh, but dur. I'm, I keep forgetting that. It's like, that's a rule that they taught you at the beginning of the game. Yeah, shut up. Yeah, up, uh, nope, nope, nope. Uh, bump it over this way. Okay, up. Uh, ugh. Yeah, 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 yeah. No. Alright. Yeah, yeah, I did it. Uh, wait, no. I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna no 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 ah poop Ugh I had it I had it in my hand and the game gypped me out of that up no 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 oh yeah 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 no 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 uh yeah push it yeah push it push it yes kick it Right now, uh, roll it. No, no. Okay. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay. Uh, 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 no. Uh, I had managed to save it, but sacrificed myself in the end because it doesn't even matter. Come on. Oh no. No. Uh, no, no, no. Oh, okay. Um. Oh boy. Um. Ah, I slam dunked it into the ground. Oh. What? Had I waited long enough, it just would have came down. Okay. Uh. All right, whatever. Jeez, this is more difficult than it looks. Come on, come on. I'm eager to see what they use. Uh, uh no, 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 uh, uh, uh. Actually, you know what, screw it. I'm gonna go this way. This music is getting annoying now. Okay. No, 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 no! Dag, corn it! This is annoying and tedious. I don't know why this has to be so difficult right at the end. You've done it. You've won. Why? Why torture the player like this? Ugh. Okay. No. Oh, no. Kick it. All right, good. Now, kick it. Bow. Okay. No, no, you don't. No, you don't. Yes, you do. Son of a biscuit-eating god. Oh, 
Yes, that can be us. Yes, okay. Okay. Oh. No. Dag on it. I could have done that the whole time. I didn't even know that was there. Oh. Dang it. Ugh. Oh my god, this is so annoying. No! Can I just start over? Let me start over. Just, just, just let me start over. I had it. I had it. And, and it was just, I was just over. Alright, here we go. Let's push you this way. Ah, you're there on the edge, right? No. No, 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 Well, I don't care. Yes, yes, like a soccer ball. Yes. Okay, now. Good. No, 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 there we go. Oh, jeez, man. I'll take this. I will take this little annoying part. I'm here. Oh, man. Okay, that took forever. Yeah, I don't know where the ampersand is. 1930s. Okay, 1930s, so I was roughly right. 1930s, 1950s. Times. Uh, I'd say about 1960s, right? Helvetica. Let's do it, baby. Up, up, and away! All right. We're here, and we're gonna do it. Don't know where the ampersand is, but whatever. Oh. Okay. This is interesting. Okay. Uh, can I find anything over here? I thought so. If you get thrown out, it deposits you down here. So maybe I have to fall out soon. Oh, bloop. Now white dots. Yay, no, don't go that way yet. Ampersand? No. Bloop. All right, so now, here's the big C, right? I don't know what happened to little C. Ah, uh, yeah. All right. Because the big C blocks everything off. And there are spikes over there. Now let's go down here. Whoop! Yay! Okay, this is gonna break. No, no, no! Oh, 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 oh! No. Okay. E F F F F F F F U C. Yeah. Oh. That looked painful. Oh. Oh. All right, come on. Wow. I kind of wish, instead of leaving the ball intact, it, uh, it, uh, shattered it. And it had a glass-like pinging, shattering sound. All right. Advertising. During the 1960s, the period is characterized by a strong industrial and populist growth, creating a consumer society and that economic environment that promotes employment. Nice! With increasing purchasing power, most homes are gradually equipped with electrical appliances, refrigerator, washing machine, television, and life expectancy increases, meaning people have more time and money to spend at their leisure. All of these, all of these changes make the 1960s a golden age for advertising. Budgets for communication explode, while the modernization of print and media advertisements sees unprecedented circulation. 
in France, advertising appears on television in 1951 through purchased airtime. These programs, which take the form of reports, interviews, or small sketches, develop themes that are supposed to serve the public interest while stimulating areas of the national economy and promoting French products. Some programs even offer brands explicit advertorial broadcasting on their network, more commonly referred to as sponsoring. In October 1968, brand advertising is permitted on the first channel of ORTF and then is officially allowed on the second in 1971 and the third channel in 1983. So the beginning of ads. Uh, this was, I guess, an, a very important, this, not, it's not, I guess, this is a very important milestone in medium because this is when we start to see the massive influx of programming uh, and ads and sponsorships and you see it in cartoons and you see advertisements for cigarettes and dish soaps and the commercialization and capitalization really begins to take off and flourish globally. So, yeah, and this music is very 50s, 60s, late 50s, early 60s. Modernistic approach to music distancing itself from tradition. I don't know. All I know is I'm going to cut the video here. So thank you so much for joining me. If you liked it, mash that like button like there's no tomorrow. Share the video with the world. Hit me up on Twitter and hit me up in the comment section below. Let me know what you think about the videos thus far. And I'm the outlier and I will see you all in the next video.